Hi friends, welcome back to Creative Unique Treasures. My name is Trisha and my husband's name is Jeff. On our channel, Jeff. And I love to recreate what someone may think is ready for the trash into a unique treasure. If this is something that you are interested in, Jeff. And I would appreciate you subscribing, sharing, and leaving a comment. That way you will be notified whenever we upload a new video. We so appreciate you taking your time and sharing it with us. Blessings and thank you for watching. Hi friends and family. It's me Trisha. Hi. And Jeff is over there. Hi. Well you can try to get your face in there so they know it. remember what they Hi. Look. Remember what we look like? We're here and we're gonna um, be doing some molds for you. Some clay molds, some resin molds, and I'm gonna, just gonna show you, give you a, a, a view of what we're gonna do. Like, um, like these are the ones that you get from Home Depot. They're made out of wood. But we're gonna be do, making some. And, the, and we're gonna be using four different methods. One is, the hot glue gun and that one right here I'll show you what that one is I think it's this right here yes this was done with a hot glue gun and it's a bird and I painted it another method is going to be the clay the air dry clay and here's a rose that I did And I did a lot of different roses and I painted some of them. There's a yellow one and a pink one. A lot of different uh, molds with clay. Here's another rose. Let's see if it focuses for me. Another method was, this was resin, but it was that clear, what was that called? That was that clear resin that was, I amazing, bought the- Amazing resin. But it was the one that took like 48 hours. To dry. To dry. And um, I'm trying to see if it will focus for me. And what this one is, is it's a clock. See, I got that one and I got, and then there's the, the regular 10-minute um, resin. And that one's a bobble, like a bobble, like a ornament. Or here's an angel that done out of the resin. It's real shiny on the back. Um, here's a key done out of the resin, like a skeleton key. Um, these here I made, these are beads, and they don't look like much right now, but someday when I paint them, I use drywall, clay, drywall paper, and then I put molds, clay molds around them to make gigantic beads. And then I'll, be paint, I'll paint them someday. So just some different methods. We got the hot glue gun, we got the, our resin, and we have a new product that we want to try out, and it's called... Resin Crate. Resin Crate. Resin Crete? Or Crete. Resin Crete. It's R-E-S-I-N-C-R-E-T-E. -E. And it's in a powdered form. And you mix it with water. And you mix it with water, three to one. You uh, three parts uh, powder to the one part water and it's supposed to be just as good as the resin as this right here the resin the real nice resin but um, it's a we'll lot cheaper out. yeah it's a lot cheaper is what they say well we, we know it's cheaper but we'll see if it's any worth, good um, so here we go um so we have some molds. Here we got the we got the key mold. Uh, we have a, a, a rose mold. We have some a bobble mold. And this is just a bunch of um, like ornate um, designs. This is another rose one with the leaves. And this is just a, a trimming mold. So we have some different molds here. I got a lot more, but this, these are the ones I grabbed. 
Um, I think we're going to start out with uh, doing, let's try a clay one. You want to try a clay one? You want to get the hot glue gun going? It's not ready. Is it ready yet? It shouldn't be ready yet. It's, it, it's not going to be ready yet. You just turn it on. Uh, don't use that one up because I want to use just a minute now, mister. It's not ready no, yet. not ready yet. So here we go. Um, let's do the clay because that, that will always be ready. So I have the clay right here. It's called the air dry molding clay. Sculptor. Sculpt. Sculpt. Sculpey. How do you say Sculpey. that? Air Sculpey dry. air dry clay. And I have some in, in a bag already. When you open your air dry clay, you gotta make sure you cover it because it because it's air dry and it dries when it's air touches it. And if you leave your bag un, unattended, it's gonna dry up. So we'll see. I haven't used this in about six, seven months, so we'll see if this is still nice and moist. So you open up the clay. And I, you don't need no gloves for this part. You don't need no gloves. You, I would take them off and you're gonna have a rough no, no, oh geez. Once you got your gloves on, you're stuck with your gloves on. And it's kind of, it's kind of dry. Darn. Okay, let's see. Oh, here's some, here's some that's a little bit more moist. So, we don't need all the, all the molds out there. On our table. So here we go. We're gonna try this. We're gonna try the air dry clay. Show you some. You break off a piece, kind of make it into a snake, Jeff. Yeah, it dried out a little bit. Yeah, it's not as moist. I probably should. You can take a wipey. I've heard you can take a wipey and wipe and put it in there or a wet paper towel. We'll try the air dry clay first. You gotta put your cornstarch in. Yeah, first you gotta line it with cornstarch so your mold will come out. So I got some cornstarch right here. Let's see, let's do uh, let's do this one. This is nice and detailed. Show them. So we'll go ahead and make sure I'm in frame. Line it there. There we go. And then Go ahead and put that in there. Push it down. As you can see, maybe I'll bring it down a little bit. They can see. Got. It. I'll take this, then I take the scraper. And I take a spatula. Or you can use your fingers like Jeff does. I had a spatula in here somewhere. By the time I find it, I have like a spatula. It's got to go down further in there. Yeah, it's got to be smashed a little bit better. Oh, I can't see if you guys can see. All right, you can get it down in there it's with all the detail. Oh yeah. Get it all in there. And then if you drag it too What are you doing, Joe?
Don't cut it off. I don't know, it's in there. Tight. I know how to do it. It's in there nice and tight, you just gotta take, start taking it away. <laughs> Look at that, yeah. It's hard to reach. That's what it is. Like, I don't, I don't want to be out of frame. No. There we go, honey. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> All right, here we go. Okay, we're gonna take it out of the mold. We're gonna, we'll flip it over. Let's see if we can do that. Now remember, we're doing an experiment. See, I would like to, br I'll brought the camera down so you guys can see the nice detail. See, now it's coming right out, yay. And that one turned out pretty good. Let me bring it up to the camera. If I could zoom it down, I guess it's this, maybe it's this level. It's not that one. No, you just gotta push it down. No. I have to loosen something. No, you don't. Yes, no, is. no, 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 no. Not that one. Yes, 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 yes. No. It's this one. Yes. Yeah. See, I gotta do something. I know. See, there we go. I don't know what I'm doing here. Maybe. No, it's way out now. Okay. Let's go down some more. Alright, there we go. There we go, guys. Does it look too bad? Why don't you grab your, the other end so we can bring it up together? And show them. There we go. That's too close. <laughs> Lord have mercy. All right. You said you wanted to have a close up, so I gave him a close up. Alright, you're being a jokester. There we go. All right, so we got one down, and we didn't kill each other. Or it's the it's January first, night nineteen twenty four. God, twenty twenty four. So it's the new year. So we're gonna put this off to the side. Okay, now I guess um, he doesn't even ask me, but okay, we're gonna do this now. I thought it'd be a good idea to have him, oops, have him join me. Okay, so we're filling this up with a hot glue gun, if you didn't notice. Um, no, we have some Gorilla Glue inside there, and Gorilla Glue is really great. It's really great, and it's more expensive than the cheaper hot glue. So we're going to use that up. I'm gonna take my stick here and I'll do this part, but you don't, yeah, you don't have to uh, use the tip because you're gonna get it all dirty. I do know that. Oh man, look at it. This is really something, man. I'm messing it up. Yeah, you're not supposed to well, do that. I didn't want my the tip of it to be in there either. Okay. So you're only gonna do one? What about another one? Um, a, another smaller one, because it really... It's a small one. I don't think so. You're gonna use a, I don't, I think you're gonna need you're more glue. You're on the bifocal range. You're, 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 I think you're gonna run out of glue. And then we're gonna have to wait, and you're gonna get a half a mold. Look at how, that's too much, honey. I can't tell where I'm at, because my bifocal. <laughs> I told you, you're my, my well, bifocal range. We're supposed to be teaching, not. I guess it's an experiment then. My bifocal range. D don't do what we do sometimes. Just. Uh, oh my gosh, it's all going there. And th that's about. Let's see how long this takes to harden. Okay, well, let's go that way a little bit with it. Don't touch it. Look, it's overflowing now. We like to be a little bit arguing. We're not arguing, we're just, I have an opinion and he has an opinion. And they're usually not the same. 
There we go. That's a lot. You didn't have to dip it in there. You don't have to dip it in there. You sure can tell that you're... Well, I gotta fill it in. It is filled in. I know, I got Are you done? No. I think that this video will not probably go out. It probably will though. Might as well let people know who we really are. Look at how that's not filled into that part. And it's not filled in well, over there. Well, I told you, you're on my, you're on the bifocal range. You're on my glass range. I'm out of your glass range? Yes. That's pretty hot. Ooh. Okay. Okay, that's enough of them because now turn the hot glue gun off. We'll see how them turn out. So there they are. And then try to keep them level. They're very dry. They're not dry. Don't. Wait. Oh my gosh, look at you ruined it. <laughs> Help me, Lord. <laughs> that's not the way you do it. Hey, it is still tacky. It's very yeah, they're, they're still tacky too. Stay away from the mold. Well, well you get you like a little you, child. You get to see if it's dry. No, it'll it'll turn like a different oh, color. Oh, it turn different colors. See, I just said it's that. It's getting cloudy. Did I, did, did I not say that, everyone? Oh, look at my camera's upside down. Oh well. Okay. Is that gonna matter that the camera's upside down? Will it be shooting upside down? Yep. You're gonna be standing on your head. People are gonna be watching you. You're gonna be standing on your head. I can do the reverse. Okay, so we gotta wait till that one. That one would probably take about 10 minutes. We gotta try to keep it level. Set it over here. You can join my. All right, so now the next one, we better get this clay put away. So, where you clay before it gets hard? There it is, though. But okay. I think you just wanted to do the filming. This you wanted to do a, a filming with me, so you could be a little annoying today. I think you're you're doing pretty well though. You're you're take you're doing most of it. We can take we can turn we can turn that hot glue gun off. Is it red light on? I don't know. Is it? I can't see it. Can you see it through your bicycle? Yeah, see, but no red light, so I turned it off. I want to get it out of our way because we don't need it no more. So I have more table space. Thank you. All right. Here we go. Now we had we did the air dry clay. Ooh. We did the mold. These molds. Air dry clay around right here. And then at the end of our video, I'll show you how it turned out. Okay, so the next one we're gonna do, we might as well do the resin because that one there, because we already know how to do that. It's not gonna be like a surprise. It's called Amazing Casting Resin. One cup. Two cups. And you have A and B. I don't think you have to shake it. Probably if you shook it, no. you probably would put air bubbles you put in Put air bubbles in You don't want air bubbles So in here's A. A is clear. A is clear. And B is more like a yellow tone to it. Okay. I have a stick. And we have two mixing cups. 
and then we'll pour them into maybe this cup, I guess. And you probably should wear um, gloves when you do this. Would be a good idea. Here's some popsicle sticks down here in the box. It has directions, comes with directions. And you should mix up your um, containers. You should have A and B. Probably you, should... you need to mark your containers A and B. Yes. Let me get my marker. And do you think this will be a deep enough container? I think so. For both of them? I think so. We'll find out. Yeah. We shall find out. Let me get the marker. I just bought a... this will work. If the permanent marker will work on here. So let's go A without coming off. A. I'm upside down. You're fine. I think that my filming was going to be upside down. No, it's not. <laughs> They're going to be watching you and you're going to be standing on your head. You're fine. Oh, you better be right, mister. I am. I really don't want to do this video again. And this is B, A and B. So B will be yellow and A will be, so you do mix equal parts. So I guess I'm gonna put my gloves on so I, I look like I am doing it correctly. And here's my gloves, Jeff has his blue gloves. Okay, we got our, we're all gloved up. Okay, we took our little, try not to mix it up. So I'll do, this is A, and I'm gonna fill it up to, without spilling it. I'm gonna fill it up to my line, which will be, I guess I'll fill it up to 25 or 20. You see it there? Yeah, go up to 30, fill it up. Yeah, I'll go up to 25. I'm gonna go up to 25 because 25 is right about there. I don't want to overflow. Let me make sure I'm in the camera here. We're gonna end up with a lot. Um, I don't think that that little red thing is going to be enough. I think that's gonna overflow. Well, then you got another red thing right here. Well, we can't. You can't do that. We gotta mix it together. And, I know and you, the go, red thing. you go. Um. Yeah. Oh. Let's see. Well, take this cup here and fill it up to 25. And dump in there and fill up to 25 again. And dump in there and see if they'll hold it. You fill that. Up, you fill this up twice and dump it in there. I'm just gonna. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm just gonna do it because you said it would be enough. So you all heard, I think it will, maybe. Let's fill this, I don't even know if that one really got up to 25. Yeah, you went to 25. All right, here's, this, here's the B. I hope it doesn't spill on me. Oh, you went too high. No, I didn't, I said 25. Lord have mercy. Here we go, put the lids on. Okay, now we're gonna pour them both in there and hopefully we don't overflow. Nah. Yeah, okay. Don't pour them in there and dump them I just wanna make sure that we're in, in the camera. Uh-oh, we're getting real close. Here we go. Right up to the top. And it's gonna get milky, which it is right now, if you can see. Yeah, hurry up and stir. I am stirring. And then you wait till it gets clear. Once 
once it gets clear, you can pour it in your molds. And if I was you, I would start picking a mold, like maybe that one. Do that one. But then you gotta find one that's, uh, is it getting clear right now? It should be getting clear. Okay, yeah, it's clear now, I think. Yeah, you're good. Okay, we're done with that part. No, don't do that. Do what? Well, don't do what? Okay. You were gonna put that there thick in part A. You don't wanna do that. All right, here we go. This is gonna be no fun. Especially, it, you're supposed to take the stick for me and kind of guide it. Thanks for your help, mister. No, just keep on pouring this way. You gotta have it a little bit more right there. Okay, let's do uh, this one. And it doesn't look like we're level. Try to have it on a level surface and then you'll be... Let's try to do that one. And we got a little tiny bit that we can... And this one will be a little tiny one. Well, you could have done a leaf. Well, you wasn't ready for me, mister. Well, you didn't give me no time. Okay, I wonder if we can rinse these out. You just gotta wipe them out with paper towel. Okay. All right, so there's that, but see, we got a little bit overspill. We did get some overspill on this one, a lot of overspill on that one. Well, you poured too much in there. <laughs> that's how you got it. That was you. Yes, I understand that. That was me. Yeah, well, yeah, I was the one pouring. So I, I, if I wouldn't have did that, I would have had enough for that mold there. Well. No, don't mess with it. Let... You never listen to me, mister. Okay, you're gonna mess it all up. Oh, well, maybe that will work. Maybe. Could be an okay idea. Let me see if I can do that too. <gasps> okay, okay. Well, let's see. We watched somebody today on YouTube and she was just making a big mess and so are we. We were kind of laughing at her. Okay, it's starting to set up. See, it's starting to turn milky. So yeah. leave it alone. See, it's starting to turn white. Leave it. Don't touch it no more. We're, we're going to ruin it. I'm taking the stick. <laughs> I'm taking your stick away. Yeah, it's starting to get milky. Uh, look at how it's turning so fast. It'll take like 10 minutes and we'll be able to get it out of there. Well, this one here is turning really good. Yes, it is. All right, so we passed that task maybe. That one there's a lot. It has a lot too I think much I'm just gonna too. throw these away because you can just get these at the Dollar Tree. You can just wipe them out, honey. Okay, I'm gonna give you the paper towel. You can wipe them out. Okay. They're, they're already they're really warm right now. I, I'm but sure you I, did mix them both together. That's that's the thing. You can reuse them. I can just get it at the Dollar Tree. I'm not that. It looks like it's pouring out right there. That's from your hot glue gun. Yeah, I guess so. Okay, I'm going to throw these away, even though he doesn't want me to. You don't have to. You can just wipe them out. Get more of the Dollar Tree. But yeah, they, but they don't have the measuring cups on them, though. The measuring numbers on them. <laughs> you are making faces at me, and I'm trying to... Okay, so... That's gonna take a few. Let's see how our hot glue is doing. Maybe our hot glue is. Okay, I think our hot glue is done. So we don't want to disturb that. But here's our hot glue. Yep, that's done. I will show them before we take it out. So here we go. There's that one and that one. So we'll take it out. See how it. See how you lift it up and it just kind of, kind of comes out. Let me see. That's the only two we did, right? Yeah. So here they are. Let me 
they turned out pretty good. They, they're not perfect, but you can paint them. They're still a little soft. So if you wanted to put them on a round surface, you could because, because they would just go around. They would go around pretty well, you know, if that's what you wanted to do it right, up, right away. So there's the keys. This is a keyhole, and that one's a key. And then, yeah, you can take an X-Acto knife, or you can try to peel that off, but I would wait until it dries a little bit better and hardens. So then you could trim that all off, these little edges. So our resin, amazing resin, is doing pretty good. All right. So I'm gonna make sure the lids are on here really good. A and B. This is like another keyhole. So we just, we didn't make a key, but we, we made two keyholes. back in the box. And the last one is going to be the powder, the experimental one. Even though it looked like we were experimenting, we have done these before. But it's, been, it's been a long time for it, the Yeah, it's been a while, about, about a year, a good, a good few minutes. I got another five minutes on them. Yep. You can put them over. Yeah, well, I don't want to. Uh, yeah. I will. Just I, they're hardened up now. They won't spill. See? They won't spill. They might get an air bubble in them. <laughs> you won't get no yeah, air you're laughing not, over there. Yeah. Because you know. No, I'm, you won't I'm get no. You a look. No, you won't get no air bubbles now because it's it's hardened. We'll see. There we go. All right, so now we're gonna. Okay. Is that the one, the light, this is the heavy, this is the really full one. There's one right there. It's not as full. That one would be better choice. Okay, so. This is going to be very interesting. Yeah. So, so we have this spoon, this fork, or spoon, fork, a I knife. We'll and, with. and it's a really warped knife, but it should work fine. Um, let's see. So this is new to us. All right, and as long as you don't sneeze in it, it's like it's like the consistency of pow of like did I don't you, know flour. Did you, did you bring in another big plastic cup? For what? Because you're gonna have one of these with water, and one of these with powder. This has got some milk paint. Should I wash that out? Nah. I mean, not, it's not milk paint, but it's dried, dried up. No, it's all right. It's not clean, clean. That's fine. It have it'll have a different color. Like, okay, now don't sneeze in there or nothing. Okay, so. Let's um, just use this. We're gonna use this right here. We're not in frame. I wanted them to see everything that's going on. We can well, you need to lift it up then. Okay, I'll do that. There's no sense of videotaping if they can't see us. Okay, I'm gonna go up. Let's see if I can see if you guys can see now. Okay, so. All right, now I don't know what he, why you're doing that because so what are we gonna do? We're gonna fill up one of them without 
making a powdery mess. Okay, let's wait and see how much this is. How much is in that one? Okay, so if you go a half and then you go one and one and a half, that's three times. So go up to the one and a half. That's gonna that's that's, that's enough to do well do we'll 50 just, molds. We'll try it. We'll we got No! Enough. Because you're gonna put you got you're gonna put water in here. So your water go that's gonna be half of that cup. Go to three fourths then, and then I'm gonna go with one fourth. One fourth water. Try not to make a powdery amount. Okay, that's three fourths. Let's see. Okay, so that's three fourths. So I only add a quarter of water. Okay, now put that, just drop that in there. Okay, this is really like, um, I'm gonna fill this up with a quarter. I think it's warm water or... No, it don't matter. Okay. I don't know what, they, they, they go slow. What are you doing? What are you doing I dumped now? all the powder in there. Oops, I spilled some of the powder. What are you doing? Why are you doing that, mister? Because I'm trying to make a mess. Now what? We don't have an accurate... Yeah, we do. I only spilled a little teeny bit. You're supposed to be the brains, and you think you're the brains. I don't know why you had to even pour it in there. You're just supposed to pour it right into that bowl. You gotta do a little bit at a time. I don't that, think it really matters. Well, yeah. Well, we'll find out. Look at all that mess that you're making. You're <laughs> God. Talk about that person we watched earlier and we were sitting there laughing at her. All right. What? Oh my gosh, everybody. Let's see how this turns out. Let me, are you in a frame? All right. There we go. Okay, well. I don't know why you don't have it all in there because I have all the water. Keep pouring. Well, pour your water in there and then... Come on. It's like mixing cement. You don't even know how to do that. Yes, I do. Sure. Okay, keep going because... <laughs> Jesus. This is not working out like I wanted. No, I, I, mean... I can mix it. You've done your part. Let me do something. Because I'm the one that has to be. It's gotta be. I, like, I, it's I gotta got, be like a milkshake. It's not. That's that's milk paint. This is gonna be like a milkshake too. It's well, then be. you you must have spilled a lot of it out because it's not like a milkshake. And who said that it was supposed to be like a milkshake? Who said that? Who said that? I don't know. I think you're thinking about. I, I think it. I think the, it should uh, be like a milkshake. No, that's me. It's very liquidy, though. I think we can add a little bit more. It's. I think it's pretty smooth. Let me see. No, I want to show them because that's we're making this to show them. Okay. I think we can add a little bit more because I think you did pour a little bit. No, no, what? I'm thinking back to that video that lady made. It was liquidy, and then it hardens. Up, then it gets thicker as it go as it goes. And I think it, I think I got all the lumps out. You want to try it? You want to do your? Try not to splash it, okay? Why do we have to do the keys constantly? Let's do. Something. Oh, I didn't have the keys. It's right here. Let's do um. Let's do a bobble. Bobble and some roses. Let's just do a bobble. A bobble. Or I wanted to do some roses, but... Okay, let's go. I think it's ready. Okay, let's make sure that it's in frame. And don't, try not to go over. Is it... Scrape the bottom, maybe. I don't know how this is going to work. It's better to be under... I don't think we're level. That's good right there. 
There we go, because it's gonna keep spreading. It's gonna keep spreading. That's enough. Go to the next one. Thank you for listening to me. Ooh. Wow, that one really filled up. Okay, let's go to the next one. Ooh. Okay, it's gonna, it'll fill on. It'll fill on. Where's my stick? Ah! <laughs> you're out of frame again. I'm not, you're, you're the one that's. No. Here. What is that? What? There's, oh, there's there's a lot more, isn't there? Okay, let's make sure that at the bottom. Okay, here we go. I'll try it. It's just like milk almost. It's a little, maybe a little thicker consistent. Whoa! Oh, geez, it does, it fills out. Fills up without even seeing it. Holy cow, this stuff is weird. It's gonna take some getting used to. Your, take your, where, where's your, where's your, uh, no, don't, that one there's overflowing. <laughs> Let me fill this one up right here. It's going to be a mess, so we'll see how it turns out. Sorry, guys, but this is the way it goes. We're, um, no, you got to put okay. more down here. You got to put more down here. Well, maybe because it's, it's um, off level. See, it is. It's off level a little bit. I got to grab another mold so I can make some more. Okay, we're gonna make a mess. The next time, this one's not gonna really be anything. Let's see if this even hardens. That's the true test. Okay, we can just cut that off if it hardens. But let's go. No, I'm trying to get it so it comes over to there. Well, why don't you scrape a little off that way? Don't tip that you're gonna run all of them. There we go. Okay. All right. Let's let me go rinse this out. Make sure you run, run, run the sink for a while. Okay. There, there it is, guys. It's a big mess. Let's see what happens. And it is 10 to 6 p.m. Or what is it? 5:50 p.m. So let's see how long that takes. Recording. Well, yeah, you never hit the off button. We can have record and then come back. A little bit less water then. So I don't, I don't know if that would be a good solution. Okay, okay, everybody, friends. Um, we got these. Th this is the resin, and it's all done. And these come out really easy. The resin, the um, amazing resin. At least I think it does. Up, so. Supposed to. There we go. It's a little bit. There. Yeah, look at all the detail on that. I hope you can see that. It's got a lot of detail. Ooh, look at this one. This is. Uh, I hope there's not a shadow. Let's see if I can put that down. That's the shell. And then let them see you trying to get it out see there we go how it just comes right out you see all the detail the resin is the best but it is more yeah, pricier we short on. this is the one we were short on which is fine it can still be a nice enough mold and then this, like this one right here, we would take and we would trim. But there's that one. So the resin is very nice. It's plastic. It's like a plastic. Um, you can go like this. Um, you can you can mold it around something just for a few little bit. You gotta catch it at the right time. This takes about 15 minutes to set up. They're very pretty. They're shiny and on the, shiny and shiny on the one side. Very shiny. So that's the resin, and that's a little bit pricier.
Okay, now the um, powder resin. The powder resin. You, honey, I want to show them. You're taking them out. Um, no, they're broke. Yeah, if you, it's a lot drier. I um, mean, it's more fragile. It is soft to the touch. Um, very silky. Very silky on this side. But let's go ahead and try. Let's go ahead and take them out. See, well, yeah. See this right here. It broke right here. So you, we can. You can always glue it back together. But it is a nice. It is nice. It's kind of a mixture between the clay, I think, and the resin. Well, maybe you use a little bit less water. It might. That might do it. Or it might. It it, I might have lifted it out too soon. And here's a rose. And then let's go ahead and I'll show you how they come out. They come out really easy. I'm trying to not break it. Well, that one turned out okay. Here's that one. And then here's the smaller leaf without breaking the stem. Yeah. And they're soft. They're very soft and silky to feel. I guess this would be a, and this is eco-friendly, so it's um, not, they say you don't have to wear gloves when you're preparing it, but we did. Okay, here's the bottle. So, see how it's already, it's very easily to lift out. So this one turned out, oh, that one turned out really nice. It still feels a little bit, um, what do you call it, like a little bit damp. And then here's another bobble, and it's kind of already lifting out, see? And it's been about 15, 20 minutes. It has nice detail. They're still warm. Yeah, they're... Yeah, from, they're, they're still now, warm, so they're still, they're still chemical drying. Now this one here broke, has broken up a lot. It's broke at the top right here. It broke in the middle. So that one will be... This one broke at the top, but it's probably, it's still good. You can just trim off that little piece right there. This one here, let's see. Like, trying, not, trying to keep you in frame. This one here needs this part tr trimmed off, of course. But here's that one. A lot of detail, it does really well with the detail. And it would be very easy to trim. Probably take a little bit of sandpaper or a real fine, like this one right here. I'd have to break this part off, which I just did, and it came off very easily. Yeah. And there's that one. So yeah, I would I would recommend the uh, resin create Crete. I think it's called. It's R E S I N C R E T E. That one's really pretty. It's got a lot of detail. It's a lot cheaper. Um, so this one here is, if I could, there you go. I just broke that off a little bit. And I would just take and, you know, file that a little bit with the emery board. Um, yeah, I would, I would recommend this. This is kind of nice. This one broke right here, but that doesn't matter. It's a bobble, you know, to hang from a tree, like an ornament. All right, and then there's the leftover that I just throw away. So that right there is the, the resin Crete, Crete. I believe that's how you say it. That right there is that. Here's our mold, and it's still wet for the air dry clay. It's still, you can mold it around something, you can bend it around. You might, you're gonna get cracking on the clay when that dries. There's that, and then there, here's the, um, here's the hot glue with a piece of my hair there. 
Um, but there it was. Um, there you go on the, the hot glue. Hot glue is okay. It's not the best, I don't think. It's not my favorite. But if I have a lot of hot glue and I wanted to use it up and I needed some mold, that would be work out. And then the resin, the more expensive resin, which I do love, but I don't like the price. So here's that one. It's more shinier. It's more like a plastic. There's that one, that one. A lot of detail. Casting resin. Amazing resin. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and uh, hope you guys stuck it out to the end. So there's a shot of all our molds. And it's, I'm Trisha. Let me get my, I'm Trisha and Jeff is here. And we're from Creative Unique Treasures. And let's see if I can get you up here. I'm here and Jeff is there. Hello. Say hi, Jeff. Hello. <laughs> hi. <laughs> All right. We thank you so much for watching. If you if you like this content, please subscribe and keep coming back. We're gonna be um, putting out more videos. We hope you have a blessed day. Thank you for watching. Say goodbye, Jeff. Bye.